five or six years ago, decided to make the real estate brokerage business the principal business. I've been in the real estate development business for years. I thought the two were enough similar that it would be an easy switch. I learned that that was not the case. I was very unorganized. I didn't understand the need for consistency in talking with prospects. Gosh, I will spend too much time at the office and not getting enough done. A friend of mine in Denver recommended the Massimo Group. I spoke with Rod a couple of times, liked what I saw, and signed up. Glad I did. And I'm not an organized person at heart, but once I started following the time blocking concept, I found myself finishing more work earlier in the day and was able to spend time with my family. I wasn't as cranky because I came home feeling unfulfilled and I got more done, you know, basically it was more productive. I would say it took me maybe two, three months before I started seeing the difference and feeling the benefits, but I'm still doing it today. Every Saturday morning, I sit down and I go through the previous week and I plan my next week. And every morning when I open the computer, I look at the pipeline and I start thinking about how can I advance the deals or how can I advance the relationships? And that's where I spend my time. You know, and gosh, it's paid off. That's the key, really. Not only monetarily, but in having more time to spend with my family, more quality time to spend with my family. For me, it's been a kind of a, a reawakening that it is a people business. And I've learned ways here in this program to better engage and to make the entire experience more enjoyable for myself and for the client, too. It's been worthwhile financially as well. But as much as anything, it's getting to know the people again and having fun with it. Self-storage sales business has been a big business. In 2021, I believe there were over $19 billion in transaction. 2023, that number declined to about 13 and a half. So I'm sorry, that was 2022. 2023, the number dropped to 7 billion. That's over a 65% decrease in that period of time. So the business has gotten a lot tougher. In my case, I was able to more than double my income during that period. So I think given the backdrop of a business that's declined by 60, 65%, and by being able to double my income personally over the same period of time is a great result. I mean, how could you not be happy with that, really? And, and I have a nice year shaping up this year. It's still not the easiest thing. You know, 2020, 2019 is like shooting fish in a barrel. But the world changed. It's become a lot tougher. And the disciplines that I gained through this coaching program have really, really helped me to stay productive and have it be worthwhile financially. If you're in the program, you're paying... For the education, take advantage of it. To me, that means doing the work. You have assignments to complete before your, your coaching sessions. My coach and I talked about people that he coached that didn't do the work before they went to the session. It's a waste of your time. It's a waste of your coach's time. It's a waste of an opportunity more than anything. Rod has a saying that I use often now, knowing isn't doing. You need to do the work. But more important, you're doing this to improve your business and improve your life. So use what you learn. You will learn things, tactical things about presence, presentation, how to make calls, how to get in front of difficult prospects. Use them. You know, you're paying for it. You're spending your time and your coach's time. Use them. I guarantee it'll work.